Alrighty, this is uh, part two. There may be a part three of uh, testing the boombox. Uh, how to pack a boombox for eBay. See what we got here. What we're trying to reproduce is what happens when you're going through the mail system, which is ramps and, you know, docks and trucks and things happen. So this is to make it bomb proof safe. Also, big thing, warning, warning, never put boom, uh, batteries inside of a boombox to mail it. And again, this is for eBay sellers, a tutorial on how to not get a box ruined while mailing it. So often it's like that's a little bit of money that that would be saving you, you know, to ruin the box because it'll just more weight and it'll smash through the sides. Anyways, here we go. So this is how to mail a boombox. Oh, shit. All right, well, went down the first layer, hit my, my neighbor's... Uh, uh, my neighbor's... Uh, whoop, hit my neighbor's snow shovel, because we got snow here in Chicago. Anyway, so that was first layer. And, uh... Woo! A little worse than I was hoping it would go. Damn, well, we may have lost it there, but that's about the worst I would do to her. All right, okay, we're going out the front door. And uh, got the trusty assistant with the killer dog. And uh, this is about a three, two and a half, three foot drop. So we're not taking. Just give her a nice off the edge. And you were supposed to leave the gate closed. Supposed to leave the gate closed. <laughs> she don't listen to nothing I say. Anyway, so again, there's that. All right, bring her back up, sweetie. Hurry, come on, we're time straight. All right, all right, go to the side. Now this. This is about, ooh, let's see how tall she is. She's about five foot something. This has got to be an eight foot drop. All right, ready? Ooh. All right, now we're gonna run upstairs and try to unbox this thing. If we can't, there'll be a part two. So remember, I'm old and crippled, and this is gonna kick my ass, walking up these stairs so damn fast. If you saw my tire changing video or my fix a flood video, holy shit, my hip was sore for a week just for goofing around doing that. So, back up the stairs. Yeah, you don't want that to happen. All right, she's coming. We did this three and a half minutes so far, so we're doing good. Woo! All right. You need to hold the camera for me, sweetie. Lock the door. Woo! All right, you saw what we put her through. Just hold it on the box. Let's sit back down. I got you. Sit down. Go. Yeah, I think we're well within not too long of a video on YouTube. All right. Come on. Film this. I hope you're filming this. Not the table. Yeah, yeah, I got you. Woo. Again, I want to take a little more time, but I ain't mailing you either. I don't do this anymore. I got a guy who works for me. He does all the eBay. I got tired of it. All right. There we go. Get her open. Get 
Get her done. This might be the bottom. And remember there was no cracks or damage when we packed this. Once again, I'm doing this feverishly because I don't want this to be a three-hour video. Oh, come on. Oh. Whoa. Alright. Nothing jiggling. That's a no sign if you open, if you get your box in the mail, lady, or UPS or FedEx, and you can hear shit jingling inside of it, man, you either videotape or just send that son of a bitch back. And damaged in route. All right. A couple cassette keys can pass. And again, willing to sacrifice this box, but she looks perfectly fine. Are you getting this, dearest? Mm -hmm. All right, now let me grab the cord, see if she still works, because, like I said, it's the inertia inside that does it, and this will be the grand, did we fuck up or not? Or our international connect service. Take this opportunity All right, to hope y'all learned something. Like I, uh, I sold about 